Sports continuing coverage of the postseason, and game number two is set to go. Both teams are lined up, and we are set to get things going. A critical game for both sides here, and we are underway. Quick shot, and he gets in front of that. Broken up by Harris. Slides the puck over. Jacksonville's moving it up the ice. Quick feed to Martin. Great reach with the poke check by Pendenza. Florida's got the puck against the half wall. Great read with the stick. The Icemen have possession along the boards. Here's a short pass to Cockerell. Great defensive play to break it up. Through the neutral zone and into the offensive end. Oh, he got huddled by Cormier. There's back to back saves. Well, he's out battling his opponent right now. He is so dialed in. He's trapping the puck, making save after save. It's about time this team starts working in front of him. Here's a pass down low. And he takes the feed. And a good save on the play as action continues. On the slot. Oh, he just had enough of that to keep it out. A well, player should never be left alone in the slot, but man, is the goal tonight. And he runs the post! My word, they really got them hemmed in here in their own zone. And they skated out of the danger zone. Trying it right to the front. Denies that opportunity. Well, this is an incredible save, James. It's anticipation as well. Recognize that the shooter is in the low slot, getting in front of it and making the save. Slick feed. The Everblades finally break the ice and get the game's first goal. Yeah, and it's an important one, James, because there's not much room out there and not much separating these two teams. So that little bit of a cushion may give them the stir. The press they need to be more consistent trying to get another one on the board. Cormier's got the puck and will hang on for the whistle. Well, he hasn't been busy, James, but he makes a key save right there. Really important that he keeps his head and focus in the game. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame. Florida's up one zip. Nice job tying up his opponent. Big save by the goaltender. We got a whistle as the puck's frozen. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. The Everblades win the draw. Dishes it to Steos. Florida's got it across the line. Here's a chance in front. Picked off in front. Through center along the wing. And now he moves it quickly to Brown. Here's a shot. Fantastic save. Well, he makes an incredible save on a point blank shot here, James. I love the way he's aggressive. He's competitive and he wins the battle. And he uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. Of zone. Can't keep a hold of it. Nubers across the line now and on the attack in the offensive end. His reflexes on display tonight. Moves it quickly over to Lodermeyer. And now he angles it across to Murph. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. A chance for the top. Big save by the goaltender watching that one. More than half the frame has been played here. The Everblades have taken a 1-0 lead. Florida's won the defensive zone draw. 
The Icemen have gained control of the puck along the wall. Dismiss that chance. Takes the feed at the point. Poked away in the offensive end. Quire's got it in the defensive end. Carrying the puck deep inside his own end. Sends it over to Leonard. Florida's got possession of the puck. The Everblades have it now. Through the neutral zone and along the boards, here they come. Oh, stopped it! What a save on the play! And there's nothing technical about that. That is all about the will to find a way to make that save incredible, James. Takes a shot. Oh, and somehow he gets a sliver of it and keeps it at bay. had the scoring opportunities, but they still find themselves behind in the first. And they win the offensive zone face-off. Now let's see if they can capitalize. And that's knocked away by Russell. Gaining momentum Great along change. the boards. And a nice takeaway in the defensive end by Martin. Jacksonville's been excellent tonight, James. They found ways to work hard on and off of the puck, and when they're away from it, they've really done a great job of being in good position to be able to take away lanes and angles, seams, you name it. But it has to translate to something. This is still a close game. Along the right wall, and into the offensive end. The Everblades have... Oh! What a score! Have the mentality just shoot it right away on the inside of the post just recognizing that there was enough of an opening and i think that the goaltender thought it was covered in the final moments of this period you can feel the energy in this crowd it's a tie game the everblades win the face -up. Shooter and makes the save. Shot! Nothing! He's in the middle of the ice and he misses by a landslide. James, he rushed his shot and that's the result. Teams are ready to go and we're about moments away from puck drop. The Everblades come up with the defensive zone draw. Drives to the paint! Denies him! Well, a nice save by the goaltender, and even better is that he redirects the puck to the corner to safety. Newbers gained the line and on the attack. Jacksonville's looking to break out of their own end. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Long reach breaks up the momentum. And he slides it quickly to Panetta. Point blank stop by Cormier. 47 seconds to go here. 35 seconds to go in this. Jacksonville's gained possession along the boards. The Everblades get a hold of the puck in the open ice. From the right side and up the middle. Fires it! Big save right at the end! There's the buzzer. Fans seem to enjoy that first 20 minutes. We'll get to the second period right after both teams get a chance to catch their breath. Stick around. And the 
shot, guys, in the traffic jam. Moves the puck. Now a quick pass to Panetta. Moves into the slot. Long jam in front, that's broken up. Florida's got a hold of the puck. Takes a spill onto the ice and loses the puck. Takes a bump but still hangs on to the puck. Now he takes it over the line. Jostled off the puck. Quick pass to Jostling. They gain the zone from the left side. Jostling's got it along the boards. Gives them nothing in front. He does a great job of having sound positional play based on where the puck is on that low inner spot. And he makes himself big, takes away the holes, and makes a save. Lots of time left in this period. It's all tied up. Scoops up the puck here. Picked up along the wall by Russell. On the attack along the boards. Moves it to the middle. And it turns off a twig in front of the net. And a stick in the lane deflects that one away. Handles the pass. Quick feed to Brown. Takes the pass. Great stop by the goaltender off the glove. Here's a short pass to Brown. They've really got him on their heels here now. And a penalty coming up as the official stops the play. Here's a first look at the power play. First opportunity on the power play in this game. And specialty teams are the difference so many times in a game. Huge for them to set the tone and really get the setup and the looks they're looking for. What a steal in his own end. They get it out of the defensive end. Florida's got the puck along the wall. Here they come up along the wing. Good reach for the stick to knock the puck away. And some good footwork to kick it away. Score! And that's his first career playoff goal, and he'll take it. Uh, he will, James, because the playoffs is just a different beast. It's not regular season anymore. You want to be an impact player. You want to make a difference, and he does tonight. Well, the game is played at such a high rate of speed, James, that you have to make decisions quickly, but there's a lack of coverage and a huge defensive miscue that leads to this goal. Florida's gone up by one here in the second period. Well, it's been a lot of hard work and heavy lifting to get to this point, just to get that one goal lead, James. Not only do they want to hold on to it, they want to extend it now. Skates to the crease. Left side made by Vernon. Goaltender covers it up. We get a whistle to slow things down. Still lots of time left in the period. The Everblades are looking to build on this one goal lead. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. And they'll dump it in. Mobert's got the puck in his own zone. Good fight for the puck along the boards. From the top of the offensive zone here. Snaps one from the slot. Score! And that's his first career playoff goal and he'll take it. Uh, he will, James. Just a different beast. It's not regular season anymore. You want to be an impact player. You want to make a difference, and he does tonight. He gets his shot off the most coveted area on the ice, right in front of the paint. Doesn't allow the goalie to get set up and puts it home. The officials are in position, and both teams are getting ready as they get set for another face-off here. Battle along the wall. The Everblades have it against the wall. Takes the feed. Florida's is moving it along the wall. Referee's hand shoots high in the air. Looks like we got a tripping penalty coming up. Mersh is called for tripping. He's off to the box.
like them working off the 1-3-1 sequence that they were successful on earlier, James. It really opens up the ice. So you're using and stretching the entire zone. And listen, there's a lot of ice for the defense to cover. So you can look to the flanks, you can look to the bumper, but a lot of options off of it. Trying to clear from the defensive zone. And they get it out. The Everblades gain control of the puck. Florida's moving it into the offensive end. Picks up the puck. And he makes the save. We'll get a face-off after the puck stays covered up. Hope everyone's enjoying the game here tonight. Another big face-off here on this power play. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back in the way here. Trying to get the puck out of his own end. And manages to clear the zone. Jocelyn's taken down to the ice. We got a penalty coming up. Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. Oh, these home fans have had enough. They're wondering what a call's going the opposite way here, Cheryl. You can hear the frustration right now with that third call in a row, I might add, James. I mean, this is a one-sided game, isn't it? Unbelievable. Florida's got another opportunity here on the man advantage. Five on three, so much ice available. You can overthink it, but you have to have the ability to move the puck. Know which side you want to be on. Onside, offside for the one-timer. But you have to make the drive to the net. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. Grabs the puck. Here's a shot. Glove save. What an incredible glove save by the goaltender. I mean, he gets out to the top of the crease. He's challenging. He's saying, hey, try and beat me on this side. Fiddler, Schultz, and company still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. They win the faceoff here in their own end and take possession. Along the boards, they battle for the puck. They'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. Trying to shake the defender. He's in all alone. Great save. Goaltender covers it up and we'll get a reset here. Power play set to roll on as the centers get ready for the faceoff. They take possession as he locks him up off the faceoff. And he jumps out of the sin bin. We are back to even strength. Solid effort by the penalty kill here. Scores! And the kid comes up clutch here in the postseason. Oh, he does it, James. Gets his first playoff goal. I mean, it's incredible the confidence that this should give him. I mean, the pressure and the stakes are high, and he delivers. Well, there's not much time here before the goaltender's eyes are taken away, James, and he drops into that butterfly position. All you want to do when you can't see the puck is make yourself as big as possible. But this one has seeing eyes through traffic and finds the back of the net. The Everblades are finding that little extra pep in their step here in the second period and have taken a one-goal lead as a result. Well, they break the deadlock, and that's huge. Now you're playing in front, but I think this face-off and the shift that ensues is critical, James. Now you got your opponent right where you want him. You're back on their heels. Take advantage and try and get another one. Nice defensive robbery with the stick. Along the half wall with the puck. Stopped by the goaltender. Here's a chance behind the net. Good fight for the puck along the boards. Hopper will stick handling in his own zone. The Everblades have it now. From the open ice, they gain the line. The Everblades take it along the wall. And the lane's clogged up, blocking that. Fiddler Schultz plays it along the wall. Feeds it over on the attack. The Everblades gain control of the puck against the wall. Good, solid check, and he loses control of it. Just a little too much contact and couldn't hang on to the puck. Oh, and he somehow got a little piece of it, and it stays out of the net. Slides the puck into the offensive zone. Moves it to the middle. Can't connect on the play. Moves it quickly over to Pendenza. And they'll be forced to regroup as the puck leaves the zone. The Everblades will play it in their own end. Florida's got it along the wall. Fire it! Fire it! Excellent stick work on the play. All right, 
We've played now 40 minutes in this one and still a critical 20 minutes still needs to be played. Go stretch your legs, grab that final snack because the third period is just around the corner. If you are the holder of the winning ticket, please take it to our customer service kiosk at section 144 on the concourse before the end of tonight's game to claim your prize. And thank you for supporting minor league hockey in your community. tonight and they lead it early in this third period and Denz has won the face off and now let's see what they can do moves it to Domingo fires it on net denies him he got all of it grabbed along the board by Mober quick pass to Carpenter change up here change they are up. on the attack and it's time to start the score and that's back to back goals well nothing like switching momentum and putting your opponent and getting two in a row, back to back. Here they come. That's great puck movement, James. Working hard away from the puck to support the puck carrier. And they gain that entry because they've got numerical advantage. And they capitalize and executed with it. The Everblades jump out to a quick start here in period number three, doubling up their lead. And it was a different sense of urgency, wasn't it? And they get on the scoreboard, so now a true goal lead, and that's quite a deficit for their opponent. You can see that they're just deflated right now. Quick feed to Martin. And that was stopped. Cormier's been solid here tonight, James. I mean, look at his save percentage. He's been excellent between the piece, and that's making the saves that you need to and you want to at the appropriate moment. Man, his team's been effective going north. We're still in the early stages of this period. Florida's got a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. And off the draw, they'll take possession. Takes a knock, but he's still got the puck. Gains the zone. Here's a chance. Way too much congestion blocks that. Puts a little mustard on the hip to knock the puck loose. Jocelyn's taking it from his own end. Along the right side into the offensive zone. The Everblades will play it against the boards. Jacksonville's got it in their own zone. Moves the puck into the attacking area. And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. Darcy's lugging the puck. Loses his balance on the play. Jocelyn's got it in the offensive zone. Here's a short pass to Aya Capelli. From along the boards, moves the puck ahead. The Everblades have it from their own end. Moves it quickly over to Riley. The Everblades carry it along the wall. Jabs the puck away. The Everblades have it behind the cage. Sends the pass over. And that's deflected off someone in front. Jacksonville's got the puck in the defensive end. Brown's gonna play it against the half wall. Picked off. Receives the pass. Here they come on the attack down the right side. Russell's moving the puck through his own zone. Jacksonville's got it along the wall. The Icemen have taken control of the puck. The Everblades will play it from the defensive zone. Carpenter's got it against the boards. right there. I think there was a sense of urgency, but he had more time than he thought. 
treat Reese with the poke check. And player hauled down to the ice. Looks like we got a tripping penalty coming up here. Well, he's frustrated with this call, and he's going to argue it with the official. But guess what? It's going to be a call. It's not getting changed. dominated in the puck possession department, putting plenty of shots on net, and they lead by a wide gap in the third. The Everblades move the puck in the defensive zone. Florida's on the attack. Here's a shot. Scores! And that's four in a row, and they are going tonight. Well, the whole bench is rolling. Why? Because they're all getting goals and apples at the stats tonight. You can feel the energy as they're all standing up. They've gotten four. are just minutes away from closing out this blowout. They have had plenty of scoring opportunities and have maximized most of them. Harris wins the draw on their own end. Slides it across to Chukarov. Moves it around along the half wall. We got a penalty coming up here on the play. There's the whistle, and here's the call. With such a comfortable lead, James, I don't really think this penalty is going to make a difference. Here's a chance to clear the puck from his own end. 
And they get the puck out of the zone, and that's a break for the squad. Oh, yeah, this PK unit, they're out there for a reason, James. You have to be able to clear the puck, and it's easier said than done, but they make no mistake this time. Puck moved back to the neutral zone. Play whistle dead offside the call. Special teams so important. Can they capitalize on this power play here with a face-off? Nearing the final minute of the third. Grabs the puck here in their own end. We got a whistle as the puck goes out of play. Here's a change. Florida's coaches have to be impressed from what they're seeing from their players tonight. All sorts of scoring chances, and they lead late in the third. Taken by Cockerell. Florida's penalty is now expired. Well, the power play unit looks stifled out there, and they have to make adjustments and read off what the PK unit scores. It's in the 